Hello everyone and welcome back to my art channel. Welcome back to Little K Artistry. I'm Little K and I appreciate you being here. Thanks so much. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing if you like what you see here. I'm doing just a quick video. I wanted to do a blowout of a design. This is not going to be a bloom. This is just going to be like a little feathery design. I want to show you another way of using one of my pouring mediums. This is one of the mediums that I will be sharing coming up when I share all of my all of my different pouring mediums and mixes that I use. I am working with a base. This is a custom purple that I mixed and I will be showing the other colors that I will be using this evening and I will put those in the information down below. I will be telling you the colors as I lay them down and then I will, I won't be doing as much talking in this one because I would like to have the art do the talking and speak for itself, but I will chime in here and there as needed. I appreciate you being here. Thanks so much for subscribing and watching and comment. If you like this, let me know. And if you'd like to see more of this style, let me know. I, I would love to hear where you are watching from and you're part of the world. So down in the information section, you can read all the different states and countries that so far have been represented. If you don't see yours down there, please drop a comment. And let me know from where in the world you are watching. It's really exciting to see where my art is going all around the world. I'm just very excited that you all are here. So let's go ahead and make something pretty. Come on down. <laughs> I'm going to start with a little dioxazine purple, and this is Liquitex Basics dioxazine purple. I'm going to do just kind of a wavy bit here to see how these colors are going to work on the canvas. I'm using some brighter colors this time that I've not used before. This is dioxazine purple, and it is one of my favorites. Dioxazine purple. This is Caput Mortem of Violet by Amsterdam, and I also mixed it with a little quinacridone magenta to brighten it up a little bit. This is just a really beautiful reddish pink. Next up, we have Liquitex Basics Fluorescent Pink. This one I've not used yet. I haven't dared to. So hopefully it doesn't look like butt. But you know what I say, if it looks like butt, at least it will be pretty butt. In this case, very colorful. <laughs> wow, that is bright, isn't it? Oh boy. <laughs> And then just to balance it out, a little bit of Amsterdam's Deep Gold. And those are the only colors that I'm using in this one. I think that Deep Gold will give me some cells. Don't know, not 100% sure, but we will we'll see, won't we? <laughs> This is just a handheld torch that I got to pop the bubbles. I will see if I can locate the link to this item. I did get this on Amazon. And if I can find the link, I will post that in the information for this video as well. This is handy. Okay, you ready? Let's go. I'm gonna put my little travel blower on low.
Oh, that is super pretty. tool again and I cannot find it. Ah, here it is. I always put it in the same place and I never look for it there. Hmm, silly. Let's see. Some pretty cells building through here. I had a feeling that gold would make some, some pretty cells. If you're watching out there, let me know what you think. If you're liking this, I really, I really think I like these colors. It's a little brighter than I'm used to, but I, I do like it. Make sure you guys can all see that there's not a glare on it. What do you think? 
I'm pretty happy with this. I might do a little bit more detail work in the middle. Uh, once it's a little bit more dry, I might go in there and do some, some touch-up detail work, bring some more color in there and kind of draw in like that. Maybe draw some more of the pink in, draw a little more of the purple in, but I'm going to let it dry and see what happens after it's dry. Might get a few more cells that come out. I'm pretty happy with it. What do you all think? Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think of this of these colors. I really I'm really liking these colors. It's it's working a lot better than I thought it was going to. I hope you enjoyed this. This is little K. Thank you so much for watching. And if you are haven't subscribed yet, if you like what you see here, I would I would just absolutely be honored if you would give us a, a sub subscribe, give me a shout out, let me know from where you are watching and what you think of this video and what you think of this piece. You want to try something like this if you do fluid art? It was totally fun and I had a great time. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a beautiful day and remember, go make the art.